What's good, YouTube family? The GDs are winning again. Salute. Let me tell you and explain what I'm talking about, but let's pay some bills first. Get your top notch exclusive clothing. Top notch is a men's and women's apparel brand. They also give you guys shoes and clothing of the highest material fabric. And, and they're selling it uh, right now at a high rate. Look for the links in the description box to get your top notch clothing as well. Also, I want you guys to check out Knowledge the God's clothing. Dome's custom t-shirts. Now, he has a hit right now with the legalized being black shirts. They're being sold out everywhere. Pre-order yours right now or just buy it right now. Check out for the links in the description box. And remember, this is a man and woman apparel clothing as well. So, make sure you go rock out and look for the links in the description box to get all that information. Also, look out for me, DJ underscore bless one. Check out my Instagram channel. Come follow. Come rock out with some of the greatest movements going on right now. Now, if you want to know what I meant by the GDs are winning, I'm not talking nothing street related. We're talking about music. Over the years, we've seen every single gang known to man and every single ethnicity, their gangs come out with artistry of work, music and everything else. But we haven't been seeing the recognition being said to one gang, allegedly gang, you guys can call it. I'm talking about music gang. I don't want to get nobody in trouble. We're speaking about music gang over here. If you some of the Jakes listening, <laughs> but we're talking about a lot of them are called the GDs, the gangster disciples. They haven't really been getting the same love like all these other alleged gang artists, gang music, that is. And the, the love hasn't been getting trickled down in the way that you would have liked to see it get trickled down. I'm here to explore today and talk to you guys about the wins that I'm looking at and I'm literally seeing. Now, what I'm noticing in the last four years, the, the GDs have literally been getting their fair share of love now. And it's been a beautiful thing because for so long, everybody else been getting that recognition everybody else been getting that notoriety and these guys have been trendsetters kicking in the door for a new wave a new type of you know what we don't care if you got the juice right now my nigga look we're gonna take the wave and make it our own wave let me explain more for many years people especially the likes like big clout and so many about many any GDs would tell you the same thing. First of all, rest in peace to Duck himself. A lot of people haven't been giving props to a lot of guys, not just in Chicago, but a lot of GDs, a lot of places, but especially the ones in Chicago. The love haven't really been showing the same way like their counterparts. And over the years, people have been blackballing them, not allowing them to speak, not allowing them to have a voice and befriending other artists in the industry so they already got ties and kinships the friendships so people are already looking at it as folks in them are picking sides not only that people are doing allegations people are doing rumors about each other as far as you don't want to rock with him he's a, a snake type dude we, we've heard everything people have said and did to make sure all these folks in them you know what i mean not get their voice and not get their way like me seeing for the last 12 years, it's been a really unfair type of game. A lot of people been using the cheat code. I'm going to be very honest and admit to that. So for me to see this overwhelming amount for support for these new GD members, it's kind of brazy. It's like about damn time we're seeing people are using the internet to not pick sides. People are using the internet to not worry about who's more popping or not. Is the music good or not? This is what the youth are worrying about now. Is the music good or not? I don't care if the rapper is a little Dirk or, and I'm not saying nothing against Dirk and them, but we did hear the rumors when folks in them get ties, folks start picking sides. And when you start picking sides, you forget that this is an art. And being an art, you have artists in it. And they are artists first. I don't know what an MC is, even though I do. I don't know what a rapper is, even though I do. But we all know what an artist is. Let them perfect their work. Let them do their things and let them portray themselves in a way that shows 
camaraderie, the uh, brotherhood, unity, because we only see one aspect of certain gangs, right? But especially the GDs get thrown upon the worst. You see nothing but relentless people coming at them every other day in, in, in a disrespectful way as far as when you talk significantly bad about gangs. They call out the GDs the, mo um, the worst or whatever. And I just feel like it's an unfair situation without taking time to be equally fair with their situation just like anybody else all i'm saying to y'all so if you're looking at a situation with the gds i think they're winning right now i feel like this is a good wave for everybody who rock with a movement like this then i clearly see there's a disparity that was going on that's not here no more you can no longer say you're being blackballed no more because you guys got the ears to the streets like i mean almost every gd rapper right now is going viral Every GD rapper right now is doing their damn thing for their sets, they blocks. You can't, you can't like get mad at the wave. I'm telling you, it's a new wave and it's a new mindset. It's a lot of the same people, but it's a different mindset. It's no longer worrying about the so-called ops. No more worrying about who's going to open the doors for me. You know what I mean? I'm about to kick in the door my goddamn self and make my own wave. And I think it's that type of vibe. That type of vibe that really made people know, okay, this is a different group not to be messed with nor played with. And I, I don't know, man. I, I like when I see uh, evolution in something. You know what I mean? Because we've seen many groups, many groups get blackballed, many groups where people are picking side and it causes people to lose money, man. And when people are losing money, more violence occur in the streets. When people ain't, I'm not gonna act in lie and act like when you making money, the violence stop, but it decreases significantly, significantly a lot. So I implore people to get that money, get that bag. I don't believe in blackballing people. I think that's low down, dirty shame, factual. Blackballing people is a is a mere obstacle in the light that you have to understand it's an obstacle that can't be it can't be respected it's almost dishonorable i feel like there needs to be honor amongst thieves even though they say there's none there needs to be honor amongst the the street life you know what i mean if there ain't no rules to it then you just got effery going on everywhere you look and that's a problem for everybody involved i don't think you want it to be like that so when we're seeing in certain cities and states only one group of gang is getting the notoriety, why do you think the violence is high? Because I'm not going to say it's going to breed envy and jealousy, but if it does come jealousy and envy, it's understandable because you costing me from eating now. You costing me from feeding my kids. You caught like this is going deeper than Ray Random getting killed now because that we, we're going to go hard for our guys, but we can, you know, do political peace for the moment or truce for the moment. But when it comes to money, one thing rule of life we know is when it comes to the money everybody gets a, a green light no no if it makes sense a green light no no basically is it is a green light for everybody because you costing me from eating the gds man rest in peace the duck i think duck kind of kicked in the waves for the gds to eat man i'm gonna just be very honest i know some people are gonna disagree with me you're well within your rights to disagree with me but this is my personal opinion duck made a movement man and that movement sheesh man it's like it's allowing everybody to eat whether you want to believe it or not duck wave got everybody ready to eat man and i like that man in fact let me listen to this right quick Don't fuck around to get that. we got more bags you get no slack I just had to play that old days GD's hit on educational purpose music hit that is but man when I'm watching this salute to everybody shout out to all the GD's out there man I'm, I'm liking to see the movement right now I like to see the unity you know what I'm saying people need to see it is a brotherhood in this thing of y'all's so I don't want people to always think it's one way. It is a brotherhood indeed, man. So people always got their own mindset, but it is what it is, man. And I'm not here to say who's the best. I'm just giving props to Duck because what Duck has done is something brazy. He has now got rid of the politics. So you only can judge these guys by their talent. You can judge them by the music, even if you do like the other side more. You know what I mean? Guys like, you know what I'm saying? 5 year four in himself, you know what I'm saying, salute to him, you know what I mean, so these guys and 22 G's, we, we, it's, it's too much, I'm not going to name drop right now, Ruga, it's way too much names right now to give props to, 
Um, FBG Cash, it's so much out here that I just got to say, y'all do y'all due diligence. Uh, quit picking sides when it comes to the music, man. Music's supposed to be a medicine that make you feel good. You know what I mean? Music ain't supposed to be something that make dudes get all uh, competitive in, in the dev sport. It's, it's supposed to be competitive in the music side. So, y'all have a blessed day, man. I'm your God Bless One. Thank you for rocking with another episode of I Smoke Hip Hop Live, man. Shout out to all the YouTubers who I use the video sources from. All credit goes to them. Salute to all those guys. Hey, blessings to everybody, man. Peace. I'm out. Make sure you go to my Instagram, DJ underscore bless one. Love, peace, and soul. Nah, I missed for scratch that. I ain't the soul train, but love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed, gang.